Have you ever been outside in the middle of the night with no lights, no torch, no civilization, not even a candle flickering, not even the starlight? It's total darkness. Have you ever been there? You know, when you're in that darkness, when there's no light at all around, it can feel all-consuming, all engulfing. But here's the thing, no matter how dark the night is, the sun will always rise and the light will always break into the darkness and the darkness cannot overcome it. When Zechariah starts to praise God for what he's doing in the people of Israel and in his family's life, this is one of the things he says. He says, the dawn will break from on high and the people in darkness will see a great light. That is what Jesus coming to earth was all about. Coming into a world of darkness and bringing light. And it may be that this Christmas season, as the world is getting excited to celebrate, you're not. Because you look at your world and all you see is darkness. It may be that as you look around our world, you see the things that are going on in the world, all you can see is darkness. We need to pray. We need to seek God because what we learn from the story of Jesus' birth is that when God breaks into the world, he brings light where there is darkness and hope where there is despair. My prayer is that God would do that in your life today, in our world today. That, that we don't look around at the darkness and see that as all there is and think it will win. Instead, we look to the source of the light. We look to the sun that will rise the sun that has risen and say you are the source of hope and you are the source of light you are the dawn that will break so today may God's love and light break into your life like the sun breaking in at dawn